And finally tonight, the Vatican unveiled its annual Christmas tree and nativity scene, which pays special tribute to the origins of the beloved tradition on its 800th anniversary. EWTN Vatican Bureau Chief Andreas Tonhauser has more. The nostalgia for silence and prayer, this is what a nativity scene should awaken in all of us as we live our often so hectic lives, said Pope Francis before the inauguration of the life-size depiction of Christ's birth in St. Peter's Square here in Rome. On Saturday, December the 9th, Cardinal Fernando Vergas Alsaga presided over the ceremony. He's the president of the Governorate of Vatican City State, which is responsible for both the nativity scene as well as the Christmas tree in front of St. Peter's Basilica. This tradition is fairly new, as it was only started by Pope St. John Paul II in 1982. Much older is this tradition in the little town of Greccio, an hour and a half outside of Rome. There, St. Francis of Assisi initiated the first nativity scene with real people. This year we celebrate its 800th anniversary. And that is why the scene on St. Peter's Square also comes from Greccio. The nativity scene shows beautiful terracotta figures crafted by Neapolitan sculptor Antonio Catone. This is a big difference to St. Francis's original, who had real animals and people impersonating Jesus Christ's birth in a cave just outside Greccio. In St. Peter's Square, we can now find a replica of this cave. We also see frescoes that are taken from the shrine in Greccio, which had been built over the original grotto. These images show St. Francis adoring the child, as well as Mary, feeding baby Jesus. The still empty manger is at the center of the large nativity scene. Only on Christmas Eve the Christ child will be placed into the pillow of straw it contains. There are Mary and Joseph, the cow and the donkey, as one would expect from a real nativity scene. But there's also St. Francis and some of his brothers shown right next to the manger. It's a real tribute to the founder of the Franciscans and inventor of the nativity scene. The large Christmas tree right next to the scene comes from the northwest of Italy. It's an 80-foot tall fir. The town of Macra donated the tree and adorned it with Edelweiss flowers native to the Alps from where the tree was taken. After Christmas, its wood will be used to make toys for children in need, something very important to Pope Francis. And there's another fact that was important for the Holy Father to point out. As St. Francis was inspired by his visit to Bethlehem in the Holy Land to organize the nativity scene in Greccio, we all should be moved to pray for peace in the Holy Land when seeing the grotto in St. Peter's Square. Peace on Earth. In Rome, Andreas Stonehauser, EWTN, News Nightly.